Hi everyone, my name is Ray. I'm from San Antonio, Texas, and I'm starting out this Saturday morning at Government Canyon State Natural Area. It's a very um, muggy 75 degrees out here, and um, it still feels good. It's good to be outside in nature, and uh, it's, it beats the hell out of being at work right now. The, um, the main reason I wanted to make this video was to put it out there that for a full seven days I have eaten a plant-based diet so um, I wanted to kind of report on how I feel after the fact uh, the first thing I wanted to mention was that as of this morning I've lost 6.4 pounds which um, is not an easy feat most of us are aware that it takes a long time to lose weight. Part of the problem with losing weight is that a lot of us talk about losing weight, but we don't really do something to lose weight. And um, a friend of mine, not too terribly long ago, um, I was on a business trip with two coworkers, and one of one of my coworkers, both of my coworkers are friends, but um, one of the one of the coworkers asked what what we would do. Um, with our free time because we were staying on a um, on a campus that had the the sleeping facilities right next to the classroom so in other words the morning commute consisted of walking over a little bridge through some trees um, much like I'm surrounded by right now the the response that I had was that it would be amazing to have that extra time because I would put in some some extra effort to make sure I went out of my way to do some exercise and she asked um, why aren't you doing that now and that, that really struck a chord with me, and so I started to, um, to attempt to do some push-ups. And if you haven't done push-ups in a while, it's a, uh, it's a pretty big deal, especially um, if you weighed a lot like, like me. Um, and I still weigh a lot, don't get me wrong. I've only lost 6.4 6 pounds. I've got probably another 20 to go, I'm not sure. But um, maybe less, maybe more. I really don't know, it's just a number. What I really wanna get to is feeling healthy and proud of myself and um, I guess not proud of myself confident in myself and that's basically what I've what I've gotten a lot closer to just in one week of, of taking this challenge again I've lost 6.4 pounds in just seven days and um, and I feel stronger than before I uh, you know, back to that push-up journey I used to be able to do struggle to do 10 push-ups on the first attempt that I that I took on. It must have been a couple of months ago now. And the other day, after not having done push-ups for about three days, I just went went at it and knocked out 35 of them. Um, I've been able to do a chin-up, which um, I had never been able to. In fact, I did three on the day that I just I mentally figured out that you know, hey, I'm lighter, I'm stronger, maybe I can do this. So I did it. It's uh, it, the confidence is 100% part of, of your ability to accomplish anything. And that confidence, to me, didn't really start becoming abundant until I started eating something that would sustain that confidence. Nothing makes me feel more confident than being able to fit in my clothes properly again. This shirt that I got, I got it a long time ago. It's kind of a vintage, you know, give a hoot, don't pollute shirt. And um, I, was, I wasn't able to fit into it when I got it. I have a lot of interesting clothing that, that I would love to wear, um, some of which I might actually have changed my mind about since, since I bought them way back when. There are a lot of things that we all hold on to, and um, the abundance that we're exposed to can become a, um, it's both a blessing and a curse, but it can become a curse in most of our lives if we don't really pay attention to how we're exploiting the abundance that's around us. Example. A lot of the people that I know have two-car garages. A lot of the people that I know can't fit their vehicles in their garages, partly because the vehicles sometimes are too big, but the other part is because we store a lot of stuff. What if we were to take some of that stuff and donate it to, to people who actually needed that stuff? Maybe we could allow them to improve their own lives. Um, I, and again, I'm just, these are hypotheticals. I really don't know. I don't run the country. I basically, if I were going to run the country, part of my platform would be based on um, sustainability and trying to help make sure that we do have an, an environment that's, that's uh, you know, that's healthy enough to, to where we don't have these global collapses that people keep talking about. Um, if any of you look around just for a little while and realize, I mean, I can walk around here in this picnic area at Government Canyon State Natural Area, 
and filmed the ground. And, uh, and just a while ago, I found some uh, discarded items that you could possibly um, theorize that you might find in a uh, in a park picnic area. There are definitely some items that um, what's the here's a good word for you today. I've heard this in the past. Um, a lot of uncouth items. So. Um, it's just it's a shame that we we pollute all these natural places we um, destroy all of these these sacred areas and um, natural and sacred is something that we should think about ourselves and for us to continue to pollute pollute and um, and destroy our natural sacred selves is um, it's a if I were if I were to say that I were a hundred percent religious I would call it a sin I just think it's a it's a big disappointment that we're um, we're wasting away our time and our beings without fully exploring what we're capable of doing. And um, I wanted to I wanted to make this clip today to explain to you how I feel about things and maybe to um, give you a little bit, in, bit a bit of insight into what it is that that I'm trying to to accomplish here. I'm not trying to change your life. Um, it's it's your right to choose your own your own adventure so to speak I'm, I'm here to change my own life and maybe I'll inspire some other people to change their lives too because um, I can't tell you the last time I felt this good about losing weight it's it's effortless as long as you eat the right food